Douglas County has 150 trained firefighter and medical technicians that protect and serve all who are encompassed in over 200 square miles across 10 fire stations. The Douglas County Sentinel singled out three of Douglas County's finest to receive the Reader's Choice Award. Lieutenant Caitlin Massey, yes, Lieutenant Michael George, Firefighter EMT Chad Brown. Lieutenant Caitlin Massey was your Reader's Choice winner for the second consecutive year. It makes me feel like uh, very appreciative. Like they're actually noticed that I'm really trying to do this job well and I'm trying to give back to the community like they're giving to us. Lieutenant Massey gives insight on what she feels going into emergency situations look like. It's always nerve-wracking and you never know what you're really going to walk into no matter how much information 911 has because the, the caller always likes to exaggerate or doesn't really say what we need but you know we just take the information they give us and kind of paint a picture with it when we get there just really see what we got and just make a plan from that. Lieutenant Michael George, a Douglasville native and Reader's Choice finalist, shared what brought him into firefighting. The economy went downhill uh, in 2008. Uh, let me know I needed to go back to school to do something to fall back on. And uh, firefighting was what come natural to me. And I know it said a lot that this is the best job in the world. Uh, now, with that, um, you know, like people, a lot of people think we do have a lot of downtime, but in reality, um, a lot of times we're doing training. Uh, we have a certain amount of hours we have to train per year to stay start state certified. Uh, we have to do hydrant maintenance, you know, twice a year. Um, we have to do pre-fire plans where we basically check every business within our zone, you know, to make sure that, uh, for one, we're prepared if that building ever catches on fire. It gets us familiar with whether they have a sprinkler system. Um, do they have anything blocking their exits that, you know. So, um, you know, look, hopefully um, we basically work I like to think from about eight to five is our busy time, you know, with hydrants, uh, pre-fire plans and training. And then from five after, it's just really up to the citizens how much they need us. Chad Brown, also a Sentinel Reader's Choice finalist, says what the most rewarding part of firefighting is. The community knowing that they feel safe when we're there. That's my most rewarding. My favorite thing about being a firefighter is knowing that I get to serve my community in a way no one else can. Being a part of something bigger than me. Check out our socials for more Douglas County news.